Hi everyone, welcome back to Bukio TV. Kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn the bell notification on. So anytime we upload new video onto YouTube, you will be notified. Thank you. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Uh, we are reaching you live from uh, my hometown in Nundo State. As promised, uh, it's been a long journey getting here today. We had to pass through a lot of uh, villages and a lot of people waiting for us on our way here. We just want to uh, reach out to you. Thank you once again for all your support, your help, your love. Uh, and we know that as we speak, a lot of you are calling your families, especially those of you uh, who are in the diaspora. And those of you who may be in Nigeria who are away from your ancestral homes. Uh, we had a fantastic uh, campaign in last one year. We had a great time. We had a, an opportunity to tell our story. We had an opportunity to move around Nigeria. We had an opportunity to sell our vision to the people of Nigeria. Most importantly, we had an opportunity to present the Nigerian people with an alternative because we believe that they don't have to vote for the incompetent and corrupt cabals or those who are controlled by cabals within our political system. And that you don't have to vote for a killer or a thief. You can vote for a better person, a better president. And uh, the reason we are reaching you this night, uh, this is the last broadcast before election. And we don't have anything to report negatively regarding the election day tomorrow. As far as we know at this time, election will be holding tomorrow. So, uh, if you're in Australia, of course, today. So it's a matter of uh, hours from now, the post will open across Nigeria. And Nigeria is calling upon you, uh, those of you who have uh, obtained your permanent voter card, your voter's card, uh, to step out tomorrow and vote for a candidate that will make your country great. So that's why we're here. Uh, we're also here probably to raise funds for the last time with whatever you can afford to support us with. We will appreciate it. We have agents. We have costs that will even continue until after tomorrow. So uh, so you understand why we're still asking, you know. And we want to take some last minute questions if possible. We're in my hometown in Ondo State tonight, a uh, small town on Askeribo, that's where I grew up. And I've also been to where I was born to the Shapomi, where my grandmother was, I mean, it's, uh, you've seen it all. So thank you guys uh, a lot. Like, if I were to dedicate tonight to mentioning names and things that we've been doing for us, we'll be here till after the election. So but I, I want to take some of your comments, your suggestions, your questions uh, before we close. For those of you who are out there on Facebook, on Instagram, on Twitter, this is the time to make those last minute pitch. We have stopped campaigning, but you have a duty to keep talking. So that's why we're reaching you tonight. Uh, how many people are watching? Six, seven. Uh, and uh, do you have any questions? So, Wow, thank you, Dr. Rupa. I spoke to the VP candidate earlier tonight, Dr. Ahmed Rupa. Fantastic guy. It's been a privilege working with you, Dr. Rupa. Thank you so much. Uh, I want to send my greetings to the DJ of the campaign, Dr. Mark Rupabi. Uh, I want to send my greetings to a lot of our members who traveled all the way from the US, UK, South Africa, Canada. Uh, some even came from Australia, saw some from the United Arab Emirates tonight, Ghana, Italy, Spain, uh, and all over Europe. Uh, people came from Mexico, Brazil, just so that they can vote for us. Uh, last week could have uh, made a lot of difference. Some of them had had to go back. But some did pay the price of extending their stay and uh, they are waiting to make sure that they do what their conscience tells them is right. So thank you guys a lot. Uh, doing this, for doing this for Nigeria and for doing this uh, with us. Together, we will make Nigeria great. Uh, tomorrow is going to be a different day for all of us. And the day after, we we'll make all the difference we we'll ask him for.
Dasi. So um, I'll be voting and uh, we'll keep you updated tomorrow. Uh, if anything is happening here, we'll let you know. Uh, already we're hearing that uh, the APC and the PDP are pitting and doing what they are most known for, the despicable, despicable act of buying votes. Started it. Someone just came to tell me tonight that in my hometown, one part where one of the politicians is based, they are already gathering people to turn print ballot papers. So don't forget to download our app. It's AAC Take It Back app on the, it's an Android app, and I can help you with meaning an eyewitness and send the report immediately to us in the way that even if you are arrested or harassed, the report would have gone as soon as uh, you filed. The job we have is to use that app to record results and send it to our situation room and our situation room will be working tomorrow uh, all throughout the day. Uh, our situation, situation room is based in Lagos. Any more questions? Do you have any questions? Coming? I'll go to the lake, take a swim and address people beside the lake. The lake is not far from there. That's the plan. Thank you so much, man. That's pretty emotional. Uh, thank you. Uh, I wish, uh, I wish, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just looking through my messages and getting a lot of uh, very, very positive messages. People are congratulating us in advance. People are happy about this. And people are saying very great things. They're looking forward to tomorrow. Uh, said, um, somebody said, we're going to give you feedback from what's happening in my area, Guadalada, and Bali. Uh, a lot of people sending me messages. My, my messages, uh, my, phone, my phone lines are buzzing and uh, non-stop. Uh, we don't have an iPhone version. Uh, we couldn't get to that before the election. Uh, so you can only use the Android app. Uh, I didn't hear that. Yes, we can. We can. That's why you must call everybody you know. Call them, call them up, let them know this is the last and this is the best opportunity we have to dig ourselves out of the hole uh, into which we Nigerians have been put since the uh, last 58 years. And also try and watch the video uh, that was released today by well, earlier by us, uh, which was uh, what we call our closing argument. Uh, I should use this opportunity to read some of the donors uh, that have donated to us recently. Uh, people didn't stop. Uh, uh, well, there's an African National Congress uh, donation that came for 20,000 Naira. I don't know where that came from. But it looks like it's a state account. Uh, there's Oyola John, 23,000 Naira. Shaq Ujibara, 25,000 Naira. Godson Matthew, uh, 90,000 Naira. It's a world remit for 30,000 Naira. Amada Su Epusa, 60,000 Naira. Palashino Steven Oloro Femi, 60,000 Naira. I want to for 20,000. Ulube and Galunga, Ariola, 25,000. Uki Nameme, Seje, 70,000. There's a lot of noise in the background, guys. Uh, people are just here having fun somehow. Probably with Michael, Ulua Sheyi, 30,000. So, yes, uh, this is your Molara Grace, 10,000. Aki Timi Timehi Ayodo to 10,000 Naira. Uh, so 
these are some of the donors today that we have. Let me look at uh, what no uh, one is saying from this end. Anonymous, 
that is Emmanuel Edo, $5. I'm inspired because Nigeria belongs to the youth. I want to see my children manage the affairs of their future in my presence. In the 60s, children go abroad to study and return home and get jobs. Now Nigerians are now enslaving themselves in foreign countries. There's no place like home. We fight corruption is to compensate people with a commensurable living wage. I have confidence in youth. That's the reason I start struggling with AAC. I'm officially on zero account balance after this five until five dollars after until put that notice. But I'm ashamed to say that we just have to take it back. Take it back now. Let's check it say you You know what? This revolution now will not be televised. Mainstream this uprising shall bring out the beast in our full and club. This this will be our regular donor. Thank you so much. For that strong closing statement. Sahid Akombi, fifteen dollars. Delhi Gaba. $25. Endurance, the demo there, $200. Said, I believe in the movement. Elizabeth Okoro Dube, $20. Uh, said, I do that because I want my children to experience a better future in the new night. Shola Diwale donated $100. Hello, our president, we wish you strength and vigor in your quest to change. Take it back. Blessing from UK. Alexander Edu donated $40 from Sacramento. And that added up to a Jaguna. Donated $150. And as we mentioned before, look at the Ogunike donated $1,000 about two days ago. Thank you guys so much. Uh, we'll be refreshing our GoFundMe account page. Uh, so, so, okay, there's a top where oh, who donated $20. Uh, and it says, I believe in you. Rallying everyone I know to vote for you. We believe in you. Thank you so much. Do we have any questions? Huh? Uh, drones. Yeah, drones will be flying over places where elections are happening. And we encourage anyone that might have the drones independently to use them. We brought in a lot of drones. Uh, almost six of them were six by the fact. The federal government seized six of the drones we brought in to monitor the election. They took it from us and never gave it back to us. Sure. Guys, uh, if you have any more questions, ask me. Otherwise, um, we might be closing early uh, so that we can rest and get ourselves ready for tomorrow. Uh, what we know is that at this time, the elections are holding tomorrow, so get yourself prepared. If you're in Nigeria, if you're outside of Nigeria, call somebody, call your family members, make sure they get up tomorrow, go vote, and monitor their vote. If you have not downloaded our app, please download it. If you have last minute ability to make donations to the campaign, uh, please do so. Go for me as I'm looking at it. We have reached uh, almost $164,000. Uh, that's close to 20% of our uh, intended, uh, you know, the, the amount of money we intended to, to intended generating for the beginning. Yeah, we are now at 165350 dollars raised. Uh, in the history of Nigeria, we're the first organization, campaign organization to raise this much money transparently and openly. So it has been a blast. And it's been an amazing opportunity. And I want to thank you guys for the privilege to be your candidate in this election, the candidate of the masses, the candidate of the people, the candidate of the enlightened, the candidate of the conscience. The candidate of revolutionary minded people, the candidate of the fearless. Uh, you know, we have uh, a lot of people around my building, the place is surrounded, you see a lot of faces. The ambient is exciting and uh, interesting. Uh, so, we will be closing in two minutes. If you have any questions, please uh, send your questions. Otherwise, we will close at exactly 11.45 minutes. Having made our closing argument, we're not campaigning, we're just reaching out to you. Nothing will happen to this communication channel, we'll keep talking to you. So at any point in time, you may get a notification that we're online. That's how we grow and just keep you informed about the happening tomorrow. You made a post earlier today in the forum language. Say that what? You made a post in the forum language earlier today. 
Oh yeah. Uh, okay, that's interesting. I made a post. Uh, there was a Spanish word that says. Uh, uh, what did it say? It said uh, La Historia me absorbera. Uh, it is uh, a a quotation that is attributable to Fidel Castro, and it means that history will absorb me. Because if after tomorrow, after everything we said, after everything we did, after everything, everywhere we went, after all the ideas and vision we sold to you, you decide, the majority of you, Nigerians, decide to go back to uh, your oppressors. You know, we tried our best in that saying that history will absorb us and every one of us who has done something different at this time to change the course of history. That's, that's why I posted that. It's a Spanish word that history will absorb me. And I did my utmost best. And we continue to do so regardless of uh, tomorrow. So thank you for bringing that up. <laughs> one day we talked about how you did Yes. Well, you know, we, will, uh, we, we actually supposed to have come up with a small 36 world documentary today. That it's coming in late, we may see put it up, and then you see how much we put it. I don't think anybody's out there who's in doubt of fact that we campaigned the most of all the candidates in this election. We did the most campaigning, we raised almost the most money transparent, not stolen money, money that is raised transparently, and we've given the most accounts. You know, we give a good account of ourselves, and that we are no pushover, and that we know what we're talking about. We defended ourselves everywhere. When we were pushed out of the debate, we went to court to expand the democratic rights of Nigerians. You know, when we were arrested, you know, we fought back. When we were beaten, we took the beating and kept going. We were tear gas, you know, we took the tear gas and kept going. Yeah? We were we charged to court, you know, we defended ourselves. You know, so everything that you can imagine uh, was done to discourage us. Uh, you saw what the other candidates did. They were attempts to muzzle us. We were looking for a party. They sent people to us who claimed that they wanted us to join their party, whereas we were working for the opposition. And we dodged a lot of bullets. You know, we can't mention enough of those bullets. You know, working with the NIP lady, we were lucky that we didn't join her party. Uh, packed, we dodged the bullet of fact, we dodged several bullets, and we formed our own political party after running the movement for about uh, six months. It's amazing. Uh, it, but this would not have been possible without your help and support and sacrifice and donations. Uh, it wouldn't have been possible. I'm excited that uh, you guys were able to work together the way we did. How many people are watching? Wow. So I wish I could ask them to share with each thousand before we close. Can we do that? <laughs> Share, share, share. If you reach a thousand, we probably close. Now, if you have any questions, otherwise just keep sharing, sharing. This is the last time before the election. Keep sharing, keep sharing. We want to reach a thousand before we close. Organic. Uh, it's amazing, guys. It's amazing. I, I thank you guys a lot. Thank you guys. And I thank you guys for also on Instagram. We thank guys who are working uh, tirelessly on Facebook, on uh, Twitter. Uh, and people who are knocking doors and moving from one place to the other. All the state chairmen and local and global organizing committees who welcomed us into their various cities across Nigeria and across the world. Uh, our brothers in uh, Abata, in Edmonton, in Montreal, uh, in Toronto, in New York City, Chicago, Detroit, in Columbus, Ohio, Los Angeles. Uh, Sacramento, oh man, uh, you guys are amazing, you guys are amazing, Maryland, we went twice, I can't, uh, thank you for London in love, uh, Treviso, Dr. Oki, I'm sorry, Pastor Oki, uh, you know, Napoli, you know, in Italy, Spain, in uh, Barcelona, uh, Johannesburg, It's amazing, it's amazing uh, what you guys did.
you guys in that so many places, places like Sweden that we couldn't get to. Uh, you know, I mean, we were in Berlin, Germany. We were supposed to go back to other cities. We couldn't even make it. We had about ten cities where we were invited that we couldn't go to, and at least three cities in three states in Nigeria that we couldn't make it. We we'll wake up. We we'll make it up to you as soon as the elections are over and we'll win. We'll take it tour of the world again and thank you guys all around. Thank you. How many people are watching now? Huh? 890. Okay. So can we reach a thousand? Can we reach a thousand? Keep, guys, keep sharing. Keep sharing. We reach a thousand, then I'll say goodbye. For now. We reach a thousand. Do you have any questions in the meantime? Thank you, guys. Keep sharing. Keep sharing the congratulations. Huh? <laughs> keep sharing the congratulations. And don't forget to, tonight, uh, change your DP to uh, our party's logo. And, uh, and encourage you to make your status update vote for show. It's as simple as that. Tomorrow vote for my show uh, of AAC, African Action Congress, number three on the ballot. It's our number. We are number three on the ballot paper that will be handed over to you tomorrow. Please don't forget. How many people are watching now? 924. Okay, keep sharing, guys. When we reach a thousand, uh, we we'll call it a night. It's uh, about 10 minutes to 12. And we want you to we want to reach a thousand people watching. We want to just see that landmark and uh, and then we can go. We can take a break. Uh, we can go take a shower, eat, and get ready for that historic day tomorrow. How many are we now? 959. Okay, we're getting there. Keep sharing guys. 961, that's where we are. Keep sharing. Share it. Share to everyone you know. Share on your timeline. Keep sharing. Keep sharing. How are you guys doing? You're welcome. To all the young kids in my village, love this. We show you to the world. Take you back. Ah, wow. Well, they know it. <laughs> yeah. So keep sharing. Keep sharing. How many are we now? Nine eighty-five. One K. All right. <laughs> Thank you guys. It's 1K, that's a promise. I know whenever you say you want to do something, you make it happen. So, he was 1K views tonight. We need 22 million votes tomorrow. We're good, right? Out of uh, 72 million, uh, for the 84 million registered voters, 72 million uh, collected their uh, PVCs. We get, uh, let's do 30 million so that we can win convincingly. The rest of the audience can share 2020. Please tomorrow, yes, we want you to go haywire on social media tomorrow. Make sure you are alert and reporting things as they are happening from wherever you may be. You know, report yourself a lot tomorrow. Be on Twitter, be on Instagram. You know, let me also thank those celebrities of conscience who, despite the lay of money and pressure, I came on the side of our party to endorse us. You know, who accepted us, you know, Sean Kuti, Femi Kuti, Duncan Mighty, Yaya, uh, Shema, um, keep giving me the names, <laughs> Osupa, King, Shahid Osupa, huh? Remy Aluko, yes, yeah, yeah. Africa, China, Tunde Edna, Edna, thank you. How many people are watching now? Mr. Jalop, I wish you good luck tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. I'm asking you to invite the kids. What do you want me to invite? I want you to invite me inside. So you want to come inside? Come on, you come inside. Yeah. Uh, why not? So, how many people are watching? Okay. So, who did I leave out among the celebrities who were bold enough to come out and support us at this time? I know that uh, busy collecting money. I don't want to leave anybody out. You know. Kevin Adoba, Kevin O'Clock News. And Joko Toye. Huh? Parara, yes, Parara in Ghana. Thank you guys. Crazy, you know. A lot of you guys uh, stepped up. You didn't ask us. What? Yes. Arise TV. 
interesting list of what I does a lot. Punch newspaper, premium times. This day, yeah, this day. Interesting list of what I does a lot. Uh, Sahara Borders. <laughs> so what I does. Yeah, thank you guys a lot. Thank you guys a lot. And all of you out there on uh, Instagram in particular, Facebook, who have been fighting very hard. One day, uh, you get the, the country you want, and that is soon, and that's in a few hours. You guys, uh, if I don't have any more questions, no more comments, I think we can call it a night. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Thank you so much for watching Bookie O TV. Do not forget to comment below, share this video, and click on that subscribe button. And remember to tap the notification bell so you will be notified anytime we upload a new video onto YouTube. Until I come your way again, stay beautifully blessed.